Okay, good morning. Welcome to Mathy Math number 176. Mathy Math number 176. Um, you picked a pretty neat problem this morning. It just, uh, it's a problem from your uh, Intro to Geometry book, and it just asks, what's wrong with this picture? Have you done this problem? No. No? Okay. If I had to guess, I'd say that something's wrong with the similarity. Alright. But let's see. So this should say that 2 to 6.5 is 3.5 to 9.5. Okay. Now why? Why should it say that? Because we have side angle side. Okay, cool. Or angle side angle, I guess. All right, yeah, and that's a good similarity test. Okay. So the question is, does 2 over 6.5 equal 3.5 over 9.5? Well, this is two twenty over sixty five. Okay. Equals thirty five over ninety five. Alright. Well, this is five times seven, this is five times nineteen. Five times four, five times thirteen. Alright. And we know that four over thirteen does not equal seven over nineteen. Alright, how come? Well, because there's no even numbers at all in this. Uh -huh. And 13 and 19 are both prime. Alright. See, everything but 4 is prime here. And 4 is even, so nothing even is in here. And this is odd. So this can't be that. Okay. Yeah, it's interesting. It's interesting. Um, when you wrote it down right here, actually, I, I saw a way, a different way, you could see that the, these two things cannot be equal to each other. So it's 2 over 6.5 equals 3.5 over 9.5. 2 you over 6.5. cross six multiply, maybe? Okay, so the question is, is this equal? Now what happens if you cross multiply? When you cross multiply, you get an integer on this side. Uh-huh but not an integer on that side. Okay, how do you know you don't get an integer on that because side? Because you're multiplying decimal by decimal. Also, it's well, it's going to end in 0.25. Okay. And here you're multiplying a decimal 0.5 by 2. Which is not going to result in a decimal. Yeah, so this is going to be an integer 2 times 9.5 when we cross multiply. So this is, in fact, what integer is it? It's 19. 19. Does 19 equal 3.5 times 6.5? And looks like the answer is probably no. Mm -hmm. Because this isn't going to be an integer. So that's one way we can see. So we don't have to see the numbers explicitly what they are when they cross multiply. We just have integer equals non integer. So cool. Good work this morning, huh?